This video is sponsored by Value Testers, where all prices are negotiable. Best online store for field piece, baccarat, and testo equipment. Special free two-day shipping available on selected seasonal products. Link in description below. Okay, guys, it's June 1st, 2019. This one here, I gotta go install, uh, replace the toilet at a little daycare facility. It's a real short toilet, it's like 10 inches tall. I was able to locate one. I mean, the price wasn't so bad on it. I thought it was gonna be more money than it was, so. It's, uh, it's an American standard. What I got there. So, that other one's a wall hung. That's gonna come out, and we're gonna put a regular tank type in there. So, there's no sense in playing around with that other one. I mean, that thing was old, so. We'll give it the old swaparoo. Saturday morning, there's no there's no kids around, so I'd rather go there when there's no one around. It's easier to work on the stuff. It looks like they're using that toilet. I mean, it's got a bunch of stuff on there. Yeehaw! Alright, I strap everything on this cot and I just wheel it right in. I strap the bottom and I strap the top. This is the way I bring them in and uh, I'll put the old toilets right in this box to get rid of them. I did get another seat so I'll probably just uh, replace the seat. This one looks, this one looks, I don't know how big the other one is. Supposedly he got me the right one but I don't know, we'll have to see. This is coming out. The new one's got the tank that goes right on there, I believe. We'll see when I get it. Oh, the American standard, y'all. There's no water in it because it was a it was a leak. I gotta take these two screws out, and then things should come right off. Kind of odd. It's leaking a lot. She seems to be okay. Beast. That's what I say. See if you got a rotted flange or something, you know, you got a good floor and you could put these down into the flooring and screw it right down. The flange is cracked. I've done that plenty of times. It's called closet screws. Things junk anyway, so I don't care if it Flush elbow. Well, I might be able to just pick it right up out of there, hopefully. There we go. She's what they call a short shitter. Yeah, that's what she's called.
That's what we call a short shitter. It's coming off easy. Oh god. Yeah, good. I might reuse those. Put a new wax on it. Just Right here, that sand. If you look for trouble, you're gonna find it. Sometimes with this old stuff, you try not to reuse that stuff if we can. I mean, if the bolts are still good, we'll see. She's a short shitter. It's only 10 inches tall. I mean, tiny. For the little preschool kids, you know? <clears throat> I'm gonna use this putty knife. Cop had asked me to use my a putty knife. I had a putty knife one time. I sure, sure. I gave him this thing. He was using it, you know, no gloves on. He said, boy, that thing's kind of sticky, he said. I said, really? Yeah, so. I said, what do you use it for? <laughs> I told him he threw it at me. <laughs> it was funny. It's a little sticky, he says. How come it's all sticky? Oh. Can't figure it out. I just put that, put it back in the plastic container, back in the bottom of the toolbox. I mean, I wonder why I wear gloves. Why would you wear gloves? I never figure it out. I don't figure it out. I don't figure out why somebody would wear gloves. I don't, know. I don't figure it out. Figure it out. That's cast iron. That's... Now, if these waxes are cold in a cold truck, you can heat them up, put them under the hot water for a while to soften them. But it's it's warm out summertime, so I shouldn't have to worry about that. Caps. I'm gonna put this on a certain way you want the that's the way it wants to go like that. Keep it simple, stupid. You can see the stuff they come with is steel. It's gonna rot. So I got some, I got some uh, in the truck. My toolbox, yeah, we use these. They're brass, they're all brass, right? Here's the brass ones. They're better. They won't rot. So we'll use these instead. I have these in my toolbox. I take them out and they're good. I'll save them, you know. This does come with you know, gaskets. on there like that. <clears throat> we'll use them. 
that much better. This other stuff here is no good. It will rot. But that thing's sitting off the wall quite a bit. There's a quite a quite a gash. He might have to put a little shelf there or something. I'm not too worried about that right now. Talk them down evenly. <laughs> Want to make sure you talk them down evenly so you don't put too much pressure on the porcelain, right? in the back there. I want to make sure it's even along the bottom. I usually grab it like this and as I'm tightening it, wiggle it a little bit. I can tighten it to the floor now. Make sure these are good and tight on both sides. treatment. We're gonna fill it and flush it, make sure it don't leak on the floor. Before I put the caps on it. I'm gonna adjust this down because it's not shutting off. Um, I got that thing all the way down as far as I can go, and I got to probably about three eighths of an inch. So that's a, that's as good as it's gonna get. I'll get the cover on it. The seat don't seem to be leaking, so that's good. Get a 
little gap there behind there. You could always build a little shelf there if he had to, I guess. She's very low off the bottom, man. Really low. I don't see any leaks. That's good. That's it right there.